Jeremy. <laughs> That's what it is. She looked at the camera. <laughs> she did. People tell with their eyes, man. Wow. Hello. Hi. I'm Mitch. I'm Ashley. And this is Membry Ash. Yes. Today we're watching season six, episode 11 of Love is Blind. And. Um, Roller coaster of love. Yeah. I think we named one of our Golden Bachelor episodes that. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's kind of an easy one, isn't it? It is, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's, you know, and if we've done it, it's an easy one, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> so what do you think? Trevor, we're Trevor's going to suck. I think the Jessica Jimmy thing is kind of over with, honestly. I think that was kind of anticlimactic in a way. I like, he was, he was being shitty there. Oh, I feel kind of bad now. He killed the man. Sorry. It's okay. Um, <laughs> obviously, Jimmy was being kind of shitty there. I think Jessica was being kind of shitty. She always has been. Um, kind of shady, but pretending to not be or something. I don't. For all we know, they were hanging out with each other the other night. I don't think they were, but um, I don't think they. I were. don't think they were. He Fucking seems lie. like a bad actor. She seems like she's prepared. You yeah, know? you're right. But I think we're gonna hit the Trevor thing today because they're gonna talk. I don't think that's gonna go anywhere really either. But all it's gonna do is cause conflict for Chelsea and Jimmy. I don't know. Jimmy doesn't strike me as super jealous though. We'll see. <laughs> We will. Do you have any predictions for today's episode? Because I'm just... I'm so tired of these people. Yeah, I just want it to be over with. Yeah, me too. I hate feeling that way. This, this, this some, some, some of these seasons I'm like super excited until the end, and this season is just... Whatever. I don't want most of these people to pick each other, so it makes, <laughs> it, makes it really hard to want to watch this, because I think realistically, Johnny and Amy are the only two that I want to see yeah. in a couple at the end of this. And I think they will both say yeah, yes. I don't I, think there's I'm any question. pretty confident. And yeah. at the beginning of last episode, we're like, maybe Jimmy and Chelsea. And then we're like, no. It's because we had too many days between watching the last episodes and then the recent ones. I forget. Yeah. And then I get lulled into a sense of complacency. But we hate them. Yeah. <laughs> They're the worst. Not as people, though. Not Listen. as people. We don't, we, I don't really hate any of these people except for Trevor. And I don't like Laura. I, don't, I hate Trevor. I don't like Laura. And everybody else is fine. I don't know Trevor well enough to <laughs> hate him. If the accusations are true, I hate him. I don't know him. Okay. Hate, whatever. I, I hate, know him. I hate, Nobody's I reserve. Nobody's asking if you know him. I reserve hate for people that have done things. I only hate a, a small. Uh, that's true. I have a very okay. small list of people that I hate, and they know who they are. They do. They know. Okay. <laughs> Woo. Spicy. <laughs> Coming out the gates. It's very small. Um, we're going to hop in really quick here. Uh, these these two episodes are being filmed back to back, too. So if there's comments on the yesterday's episode, I didn't get to review them before we're doing this one. So just keep that in mind for commenting. Like, I mean, you can say something twice or something somebody's already said, but we haven't been able to change our opinion based on what you've put in here. That said, we are going to be doing another comment wrap-up video at the end of the season, like the mid-season one, one through nine that we did. So if you want us to share out your comments, we're going to kind of pick out ones that we feel like kind of impacted our perspective on things yeah, and, um, and put those up on the screen. And then kind of talk it through. Uh, if you're interested in that, put a comment down below. And uh, and if you want us to share your username and stuff to kind of give you credit, like let us know that we can do that if you haven't already. Anything else? No, I just want to get this. We'll get show it over with. Yeah. On the road. Go eat some dinner. All right, let's hop in. Talk about your fit, bro. The soprano fit. <laughs> oh, more people I don't know. Oh, and Sarah. Did you see him squint? Yeah. Do you think he wants to be with Sarah Ann? What do you think about that? Uh, no. <laughs> you think he wants to be on camera? Jeremy? Yeah. I don't know. I know Sarah Ann does. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so awkward. What do you think they talked about? Do you think they talked about getting back together? Do you think they just talked? Maybe. What's He's your sighing. Uh, maybe. Like. I to come today. I just it was at least weird. It was at least weird. Like adults. Adults. Yeah. So I feel like the odds adult that things could happen. Happened, yeah. And he would lie about it for mm -hmm. sure. Well, like you saw pictures of the mullet. I creeped on you a little bit. Did you? Yeah. You only had like one post when I followed you. So. Yeah. There's a, there's a reason. There's a reason. Because it's a fake account. You had one post. That is 
red flag. You only had one post. Everything else. Oh man, would be my hunch. This I don't is like know. some people Allegedly. say they won't date people without uh, social media histories yeah. because you don't know if you're if you're gonna get Trevored. Yeah. That doesn't mean it was a wrong decision. He could have had more airtime. He could have. Do you think his girlfriend was like, okay, do you think she was like, yeah, go ahead and sleep with her? Or like, no, would no. would he have just been one of the ones that was like, we're not gonna do anything? Because she seems Maybe. really sexual. So yeah, like, I sure. doubt she would have been okay yeah. having a partner that was not Yeah, interested. and that could have been a conflict for sure. Up until the last day when I wasn't. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Going yeah. into the last day. He obviously doesn't value his girlfriend though. Mm-hmm. Damn you. I know, I'm sorry. It's I'm okay, it's okay. Well, he values his potential for, like, earnings, fame, fame more. Yeah. And you were giving that to me? Yeah. And, um, which is, you know, that comes with an engagement, but I feel like it would be really fun and easy. With Why is she still talking to him? Like, they're in the pods. Stop it. You're with Jimmy. No. Even if I did something terrible, I don't see you, mm -hmm. like, yelling. You're doing something terrible right now. She'll whine you to death. No, oh, yeah. She'll nag you. Yeah. You been out each other's throats? Yeah, I got a dirty martini drunk the other night and... Never had a dirty martini. What? Never had a dirty martini. I Me feel neither. Like I'd like to try one because I like olives. Me too. Yeah. Ooh, I love an olive. Or maybe I just want to eat olives. Debatable. It wouldn't be an argument if you thought you yeah. were 100% wrong. Yeah. <laughs> I just delivered it. <laughs> Who needs booze when you have olives? Absolutely. Do you, you don't want to talk about it. <laughs> That's appropriate, not talking about difficult things with your former sort of date option. I still think she's saying stuff Too to much. him that she shouldn't be yeah. saying to him. I, I wish we could play out both scenarios. Mm -hmm. Ultimatum, that's what that is. You get to play out both scenarios. Ultimatum, but you come into it with your love is blind pairing, uh -huh. and then you see and try it out with mm -hmm. the other person. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That is a whole crossover mess. They really could have done that. They could have done that. They had enough yeah. like love triangles. They could have done it. Great. I feel uncomfortable. Jimmy. I would like a kiss on the cheek. <laughs> <laughs> Angel came to save. Hold a fucking hug, dude. I respect Jimmy's relationship with Trevor as much as I don't respect Trevor. You know, yeah. like, like I like that Jimmy's not, like, threatened yeah. or anything. Have you met? I love Johnny and Amy. They're just hanging they, out together. Everybody's calling them the strongest couple. Yeah, because they everybody clearly knows it. are. They're the strongest Maybe. couple. They're, they're, Jimmy, they clearly don't be are. Don't Can't say it. Okay. What did I say? I think that makes me feel Oh, Jimmy, don't get in your feelings, dude. It's objective. It's objective. These people are both just terrible. Ugh. Don't get offended when somebody says facts. Right, it's just facts. It's okay. It's just facts. It's just okay. <laughs> man. Is he upset because... Because she said Johnny and Amy are a better couple than them because from the outset he has been weirdly obsessed with being the best couple. Yeah, right? So weird. If you were joking, it's fine. No, it's serious, dude. Like, get your head on straight. Has it oh, they're gonna talk. She's wearing a thong bathing suit under that thing. Do you see that? Dang. A lot of choices there. And I felt like I just kept getting like rude responses. I don't know what you kind of expect after that, honestly. Like, as I get is, it sucks to know that your name changed from fiance to just Jeremy in my phone. That is passive aggressive. Well, is that aggressive aggressive? Yeah. Is that passive aggressive? What is that? It's something that's not very clear communication. Authentically me since day one when we met in the pods. You on the I'm other not hand are a have... con artist. She called him a con Whoa. artist. Woo. Get your feelings or much of anything and you're going to flip it around on me yet again. Wow. And she's not going to have it. This with the best intentions. Well, I definitely don't believe that. Well, it's possibly came in here with the best intentions for the beginning of the show. Yeah. I'm not saying this, not this like barbecue, but um, like going to the show, hoping he falls in love with somebody and not feeling confident with Laura. Because yeah. if he was fully confident with Laura, I don't know if the Sarah would be happening. Yeah, maybe it's like he came into the show yeah. with good intentions, but then... I don't think his intentions with him talking to Sarah Ann were particularly no, not good. not at all. At the point that he's chosen Laura, it's all a meltdown from there. Joy and happiness. What is What happens in your head? He takes no accountability for what happened. Yeah. So for him, it's not his responsibility to come and apologize yeah. to you. You made your mind up a week ago. I didn't. As far as I'm I concerned. didn't. 
agree to disagree. Well, she's saying you made your mind up when you decided to stay out until 5 o'clock a.m. hanging out with Sarah, and I would agree with that. He did make the decision that it wasn't important enough to him yeah. how hard it would be on her and yeah. whether she cared. Yeah. He doesn't seem to give a still. No. I do like how direct she is. Honestly, like, I like I'm not, that. I can't be, that's like the, the swearing and stuff, even I'm like, whatever. Yeah. Because it's not, she's not screaming obscenities at him. She's using, she's using them to accentuate her frustration. Yeah. I don't know. Flee the scene of the car. Oh, Sarah Ann is like mildly happy about it. Of course she is. No one needs to beat his ass. He doesn't deserve anyone's attention. Are he and Sarah Ann even going to like get together? What's the point? I don't think so. Oh. I saw the DM. Mm -hmm. That you said to him. Oh, yeah. oh AD. AD, calling it like it is. Tell her AD. And not to interrupt you. No, but you are. Aware no. of the situation. Hold on, I didn't finish. Yeah, AD. Yes. I didn't yeah. answer. I didn't finish my question. F yeah, dude. Well, and she's holding Sarah Ann accountable because they were friends in the yeah. pods. Oh, they so, like each other in the pods? Of course, yeah. then. Like, your friend is the person you talk to. She doesn't even know Jeremy. Why would she go up to Jeremy? I actually think this is great. If the door's still open and she says, okay, I read it. Yeah. Being like, yeah, you did. Because she did say if the door's still open, right? Yeah. From my perspective, yes. In what way, from your perspective, did he... <sighs> I'm in the pods. I got to know him as a person. I'm in the way. Oh, she's so mad. Me pick me, and I'm not gonna. Convince, Nobody wants to be a pick me. I'm not gonna convince a man naturally. To be with me. Naturally. Naturally. No one wants to be a pick me. <laughs> what? Except that chick from Grey's Anatomy. That I do want to talk about. I was out Please. drinking for three plus hours with friends. Yeah. All of a sudden, he's there. So, sure enough, we had a conversation. Ad does not seem like she is tolerating this at uh -huh. all. So her, he sent her. His location. AD knows all the dirt too. Day I die, oh, I did not he? cross the line with him, and I did not let him in my house. Okay. Fair with him too. I was like, you need to figure that out with Laura. I'm not gonna be in a love triangle. But like you were though for and like she the put five hours that you yeah. guys were talking at night. Any way mm -hmm. that I can present that Jeremy and Laura are engaged. <laughs> Oh man, AD's like you got to be responsible because for your actions. It's not yeah. okay to be a home wrecker. Yeah, is the reality. Yeah, if you it's know that the person yeah. is in a relationship, you don't go seeking that person. Yeah, period. Yeah, it's bad behavior. Yeah, and you can say all day that 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 Jeremy acted like. And he, he did, did, but so did she. And this is an, another example. Jeremy doesn't want to take responsibility with Laura for doing yeah. anything wrong. And Sarah Ann doesn't want to take any responsibility no. for being really it to Laura. Is really and this is another case of just no accountability. I mean, you know, or wild. So don't finish my sentence. Oh, can I? Oh, someone, someone give AT an award. She's such a good friend too. She is She's such a good friend. He did not choose you. Okay. So for you to then say she's not being mean to Sarah Ann, but she's just yeah. saying your behavior was AD not okay. AD is the kind of person that you want to know. Yeah. Because she's never going to cross you. She's never going to f*** you over. She's, yeah. she's going to tell you like it is. Yeah. And she's not going to hate you after maybe even having a tough conversation. Yeah. Like, AD just seems like... We got ripped up for liking AD so much by, like, one, one person. person. But I like, stand by I it. I stand by it. I like I AD. I stand by it. Matter, you know? Like, I'm just I've always loved you. I've always liked you a lot. And she doesn't like it because AD is being real with her and not yeah. having it be with someone else because Sarah Ann's behavior was terrible. Yeah, dude. Um, Laura, Laura's a big... Laura's my number two, but she's kind of mean. <laughs> She is mean. She, she is. is mean. She's also mad and yeah. justifiably yeah. mad. And people are mean when they're mad sometimes. Let's go and talk. What do these two schmucks have to talk about? And now we're going to take a quick ad break. We'll be right back. Go talk some more, cuties. Go f talk. It is really nasty because Sarah Ann could have just let them. They probably would have broken up anyway. Yeah, absolutely. And she could have just let them break up. And then she wouldn't be a homewrecker. Yeah. And Jeremy wouldn't be a liar and a cheater. Because I still maintain it. Emotional cheating is cheating. Yeah. Tensions were not to hurt anybody. What? That's bull. She's a liar. I hate hearing that from people, too. You do something and then you go, oh, but my intentions were yeah. good. And it's like, stop it. No. Honestly, the intentions don't matter because you did hurt people. Yeah, you did and, hurt people. And secondly, she didn't give a or she did mean to hurt people. That's yeah. garbage. That's a lie. It's an intent versus impact situation. And then it's At also best. like, it is so 
crazy to say yeah. that you can't see that it would hurt someone. Like, they're painting me out to be this person. You are. I'm this floozy that goes after men that are engaged. You're I'm not. I'm a real- You did. You did do that. That yes, is what you she did. is. It's just as much a part of this as anybody fucking I'm a realist? You're lying to yourself and everyone around you. People, these two deserve each other. They, they do. Because they both lack massive amounts of accountability. Yeah. Just be the victim, Sarah Ann. Everything will Both be better. Both of these people are doing that, though. Yeah, you're They're right. They're like, I'm the victim. I'm the victim. No, you're not. Stop yeah. it. Sometimes people do crappy things. Just be like, yeah, I did something. I shouldn't have done it, and I'm sorry. I yeah. didn't want... I, I'm i sorry I hurt people. Yeah. The end. Well, you're not going to get that from these idiots. It's people. So then why are you worried about what they're saying right because now? Because it hurts, Jeremy. It doesn't matter who... Because it's on camera. She looks at the camera when she says that. Because it hurts, looks at camera. <laughs> She's like, they're filming this shit, Jeremy. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is. She looked at the camera. <laughs> she did. People tell with their eyes, man. Wow. Send a message or that my feelings aren't valid or that the conversation should Sucks to have your <laughs> side films, doesn't it? Cotton 4K, is that what they call mm -hmm, that? Yeah. <laughs> the reality of it is it's messy. It can be difficult. You don't have to hurt people with your mess. You can be messy yeah. and have it be difficult by yourself. And I'm not sorry. I'm not, I'm not sorry. Oh. We know. Oh, shut up, Jeremy. You two run away together. Who the f cares? I made the wrong decision in the box. And I think you know that at this point. Yeah, he's over here saying he was trying to send Laura flowers and now he made the wrong decision because there's no chance there. This guy's a snake. He's a con artist. He's a con he's artist. He's a con artist. Congratulations, Laura. You are correct. And he is a con yeah. artist. I hate saying Laura's correct. I have to, I have to, I have to say every time that we agree with Laura that I don't like Laura. I don't like Laura either. <laughs> but he's, she's right. He's a con artist. He is. Oh, it's cold. <laughs> and now they're jet skiing together. Do I respect Sarah Ann? No. None of us do. None of us Nobody respect should. Sarah Ann. At Nobody this point. should. Would I trust her around anyone? No. No. Not even my grandma. That's weird. Hey, grandma. What's she doing with your grandma? I don't know. <laughs> she might smother her and try and take her money or something. I don't know. <laughs> Yeah. And that, that sucks how much he's just like, F you. It's so messed up to do that yeah. in front in front of yeah. Laura to do this sucks. Yeah. Well, they're laughing. These yeah. people are idiots, man. They're just having a great time while Laura's upset. Uh, and he knows Laura's going to be upset. It's, it's time to move on with our lives. <laughs> Jesus, they're manic right now. They just got finished crying and fighting. And now they're laughing like, ah! I know. It's giving... A little off. Jeremy's mom is going to be very disappointed in him. It's got to be pretty bad when AD is literally like, I'm on Team Laura. I know. Come oh, on. you're right. Even Jess was less disrespectful mm -hmm. than Sarah Ann. Yeah. Jess wasn't like DMing Jimmy yep. and trying to meet up with him separately and talking to him until 5 a.m. Well, that's because she's on Perfect Match too. She doesn't care. <laughs> Sarah <laughs> Ann isn't. know that yet, though. Well, maybe she does. I don't know. Go. You look good, babe. There you go. What's happening? Why are they doing this? Yeah, Ice I'd like sculpture? leave it to the professionals, you know? What's the point of this? I don't know. Because it's going to melt soon, right? Or are they going to put it in a freezer for a couple of weeks until the wedding? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe they said that already. Are they making a luge? Like a shot luge? A shot luge. Again, I think you leave that to the professionals. I think I would rather have like non-alcoholic beverage inside of it, but I would like something cold straight yeah. from the ice luge. Yeah, that sounds fun. <laughs> How do you feel? I'm, I'm really happy. I like doing things like this with you. It's, it's ugly. <laughs> it is. Did you see it? Just like their relationship. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, burn. It's the best feeling ever, you know? Mm -hmm. I love the way you love me. They also show, like, the worst moments. That's true. That's we true. We didn't talk about this, but the fact that she, like put on camera that he slept with his friend that he wasn't ever intending on being on camera. Like he told her something off camera. That he wanted she to knew, keep off camera. Exactly. That he did share with her, but he's like, I don't want to talk about this on yes. camera. And then she brought it on camera is like, oh, I don't like that. Yeah. I don't like that at all. That's like a breach of trust. Yeah. And if you like agreed to it. I think he told, I mean, he told her because he wanted to be honest. Oh my yeah. gosh. Where does Clay get his clothes? Because. Oh. What is this? I am into it. Do you Sneaker see? connoisseur. Do you see right. his uh, sweater right now? I didn't. Amazing. Let me see. I kind of do want to do something like 
glamour. Look at that. Oh yeah. I love that. It looks a little heavy for that weather where they live. Maybe it's a cool day and I don't live there, so I don't Maybe I don't... he runs cold. That's, Some people that's true. are cold all the time. Well, and, and I think um, certain times of year that weather's pretty similar to like what we got here. You may have like a cool morning and a hot day kind of thing. Wedding day like. Okay. Yo, damn, you killing it. Damn. That's really cool and I would hate to do that because I feel like mine would look like garbage. Mine would look like garbage yeah. too, yeah. I can't paint in lines. They have well, tape, it looks like they're struggling though. a bit too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's true. I don't know if they're ready to get married, but they're cute. Yeah. I would absolutely love that to okay. be there. I think it's a really Yay. good touch. Okay. He's so supportive. Yeah. Every time she says something is important to her, he's like, He says, I yes. love it. It's like a surgery for a vasectomy, which I didn't realize what that actually entailed. So maybe in like, oh, absolutely, I'll do it. Like, mm -hmm. I didn't realize how actually severe that was. Yeah, it's a it's big It's pretty step. bad, yeah. For some people, it's yeah. not reversible at all. Yeah. They go in, they cut a you. Uh, <laughs> Okay. Well, people can Google it. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. You don't, don't have know to know. Showing it. The effects will be in the future. Yeah. Um. Again, not com not opposed to it. I've Do you know what I heard? And I don't think that they cover a ton here, but she actually has some pretty severe health issues, and oh, that's really? why she's nervous about taking oh, birth control. Oh, okay. It's also at one point she says, "Like I have to get infusions." Like. Oh she, really? Yeah, like she has a serious health oh, condition okay. that is just not being addressed. That she needs to be careful about what she does oh. with her body. Well, thank you for that bit of information there. Yes. Yes. Adding context. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's important context because it's kind of it like it, a lot of people just take birth control without even having to think about it. Not that you like she has every right, even without all that stuff, absolutely. to be like, "Hey, I'm not ready for that." But absolutely, but it just adds a degree of complexity for yeah. her that might not be there for someone else. Yeah. This is so. Hello, brides to be. Vanessa. Hi, hi, hi. 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 How, are How are you? I'm good. Does she always come? I feel like she doesn't normally so. come, right? I feel like this is new. This is new. What's she doing? doing Trying to get some screen control. time. They found out about Trevor. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Send in the laches. Round them up. Hey, come on over. Join me. Nah, Nick. He, he, Nick should lead them in like an acapella breakout. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> right? Absolutely. Harmonize. Yeah. You were here today for her. That is right. To pick out her dream wedding that dress. Right. Yeah. Oh. And girls with this guy, so. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, you know. He's Josh, you and Josh J, the Joshes. That's cute. I feel like there's still a chance that either of these other couples say yes. I'm not sure it's the right choice. Yeah, that's true. But. I mean, a lot of people on the show get married and then just divorce after like less than a year or a yeah. year. How are we feeling over here? Luckily, the woman I chose the best decision I've made and. He is such a weirdo because they have these big fights and then he says these things. Like he literally will say to her, like, I don't know about this. Mm -hmm. And like, you really hurt my feelings and all this stuff. And then he'll go to a barbecue and be like, we're the best couple. I know. And I'm like, you're not though. Will you say I do? Or will you walk away forever? I love that they, I still can't get over that they ended with Kenneth and Brittany and they didn't even really give us any closure. They yeah. never spoke to each other again on camera. Yeah. Like that is a lot. And they weren't, they, they weren't at the barbecue. Versus they all the these, barbecue. yeah, dude, they're gone. What? But like Jeremy and Laura were at the barbecue. I know because they, because Kenneth wanted nothing to do with it. Yeah. It was weird. It was honestly weird yeah. the way that went down. I didn't get we're to experience this. No, this. I was is... 18, you know, yeah. I didn't, I didn't get to, Bring my people and I have no desire to experience a wedding. Like Ever personally. Again. Yeah. Like we personally the, or going to other people's. <laughs> we went yeah. to the courthouse and that was good with me. Yeah. I do not want to be stared at by a whole bunch of people while I like walk down an aisle. I don't want to. Oh, you did be... this wrong. Oh, right. this wedding is like lame. It's I don't want to hear so it. So judgmental. People yeah. are always like, oh, the All food they do wasn't judge. that good. Yeah. Like, the flowers weren't beautiful. Did you see the colors? Becky's they was better. <laughs> no. I need mean, I'm happy for you. Thanks, man. Ba -do -ba -do. Oh, oh, I, can't, I can't move. <laughs> People try on dresses <laughs> and suits. For you. Literally made for you. And they always say that. I this know. one was made for you. You know, I didn't get this in my first, first. 
go around. Oh, I'm glad that she's getting like. Oh, that's what true because she... she's been married. I forgot about yeah. that. Yeah. I feel so confident in Jimmy and I. You're the only one, girl. Uh, You're the only one. Every time. But if you feel confident, you know, I'm yeah. going to send positive vibes your way. I just, I hate to see her not confident. <laughs> it's true, though. She you feels confident for her. So many burns today. Yeah, I mean, like, I'm going to call out of control. Call him like I see him. But you're doing great. Yeah. Seen you in a tux before? No. So how you think she go how do you think she's going to feel looking at you? I love that he has two Josh Joshes. Wait, wait, wait. I, I think they're both like slightly bigger dudes, right? Same height. Yeah. Do they all both have beards? Oh my god. I just got chills. <laughs> oh my god. That was good. Yeah. She looks gorgeous. Per usual yeah. though. When does she not look gorgeous? And I pay the bill. I never Amber. Oh my Is that what happens when you try on a wedding dress? You immediately cry. You have to. I mean, I wouldn't know. I've never tried one on. You look like a princess. Aww. Thank you, Joelle. Oh. How do you feel? All these J names. Joelle. I see them everywhere now. Yeah, she's picking that one. The leg yeah. slit on that one is impressive. Impressive. I wouldn't have one of you because I, I thought this wouldn't come for years. <laughs> and. Call your parents old without calling your parents old. I know, know right? Thought one of you were going to croak by now. Really thought you'd oh, be dead. Jesus. <laughs> days away from our wedding. Clay is setting up a date for me. Oh, he set up a date for her. Finally, Clay, That's nice. step up. It's giving fiance. <laughs> I, I'm getting exhausted with the, it's giving. <laughs> it's a lot, it's a lot. It's giving happy, it's giving elated. No, stop it, <laughs> right, don't I'm add sorry. more. All right, all right. That's what people are saying afraid of in, in the Clay D dynamic though, is where like she's gonna just be another like trying to fix him and it's she's just, the one doing all the labor. It feels, and I can see that. And yeah, yeah that would be a, con it is a concern for sure. I just feel like I see him putting in that effort. I, I, I'm, I'm gonna say with them, I can, I could see it going either way. I yeah. don't, I, like with, with them, if they did get married, I wouldn't just immediately write it off. I'd, I would think, well, if he can just like if keep he... it together and never cheat on her and never kind of f around, then, then I think they could be a really good couple. I think I worry for them that if they say yes, if he says yes, I believe, like, I believe they're going to do it. I believe okay. in them and I send positive vibes their way. My concern is that there have been couples on here that people don't like that then go on to get married and people, they do, they're apart. relentless yeah. for years. Yeah. They'll be posting mean things on their Instagram. They could have a kid saying, and stuff and yeah. they'll be like, oh, these people suck. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. And people like aren't happy for them. And I mean, it's really ugly to see. I think especially at the point that they say yes, like let them live their life and see what happens. Absolutely. Like if it comes out um, that you know, it's all blown up, sure. Like maybe talk about it a little bit if you want, but right. like let them live. And this is at the end of the day, this TV show. Yeah. So we're seeing snippets of things. Edited strategically. And that's not everything. Yeah. Yeah. I still don't, I don't like this relationship. But if they get married also, I wish them the best and I hope that they figure it out and I hope yeah. that they work yeah. on it. Yeah, I agree. But it just, to me, they have well, the most to work on and the biggest, I like, agree. uncertainty about whether they can get through it in a way that's healthy for mm -hmm. both of them, too. People that don't work really well can still make a relationship work given enough time and effort. Like, it, you can never fully predict it. Unless it's a situation where somebody's literally abusive, I think like yeah. a lot of a lot of relationships can be complicated. A lot of relationships can even be harmful, but it can still be fixed. Yeah. Oh, oh my God! I can't believe my eyelashes are still intact. That was awesome. <laughs> I like a roller. I haven't been on a roller coaster. It's been oh a while. my goodness! I haven't been on a roller coaster in so long. I feel like some days it's hard for both of us. Yeah. Some days we like test each other and. And so we should break up. <laughs> I'm just trying to help her out here. Yeah. <laughs> I loved you so much, and I have no doubt in my mind that you're my person. So he's saying yes, right? It, do you think? You can't say like that without saying yes. I haven't even got a grasp of where you're at. She would be the one that would say no, right? At this point, maybe. I don't know. Are you gonna marry him, Chelsea? <laughs> Are you gonna you gonna get married or, or no? Give an answer. Oh, cliffhanger! Oh, and she's getting emotional. Oh, 
Awkward. This could all be editing, but also awkward. Awkward. Aqua taco. Stop saying that. I can't. Ah. <laughs> what, you don't like tacos? <laughs> I'm confused. Is that it? Is that okay, it? All right. all right, good. All right, good. good. I don't good. want more. Honestly, I was getting a little over it at the I end there. I don't want any more. I don't want what you're selling. Netflix. Uh, we'll just take your ear out. There you go. Boom, done. How does you feel about episode 11, Ashley? No, we dropped the dues, so it's how feel. How feel episode 11, <laughs> Ashley? We dropped the dues. That's what happens at the end of episodes. I can't say do for the rest of the... You dropped the do. Okay. Um, I feel that Johnny and Amy are little angels. Angels. And they are going to get married yeah. and eventually have little babies. And they're both going to be great parents and wonderful partners. They're both going to say I. <laughs> exactly. Yep. They will. At the altar. Yes. Um, <laughs> and then I think uh, you agree, right? Disagreement? Yeah. Anything? No, I agree. Change? Okay. I think Clay and AD, I'm going to go I'm gonna go on a limb. You know, I'm just, I'm always... I'm dying Maybe, on that hill. Yeah. I think Clay and AD are both going to say yes. And I don't know how that's going to go. But... It's weird how much they both seem to want to get married. I think Clay might say no. I think Clay's going to say yes. I think if someone says no, who would it be? Clay. Clay. Okay, you agree with that? Yeah. Okay, but I also almost feel like he would want to say yes because he knows AD's like the best in the world and he yes. doesn't want to disappoint her because she's like, you see, like, I'm doing this only. I'm not going to date yes. after this. And she's standing right there yes. looking like her, yes. being like, I do, I, I, <laughs> being like, I, and then he's going to have to say I. Yeah, he is. Yeah. I think also that his she's been open to his concerns which mm-hmm. i think is really healthy her mom was really helpful her and mom open was more supportive than i thought she was about gonna be, his honestly. concerns and i don't think he's ready to break up with her yeah, so I yeah think that's the thing i think he almost get might get married just because he doesn't want to break up with her which could be an unhealthy thing but that's back to what we we're saying like maybe they could maybe they could work it out sometimes like it's if he were saying i never want to get married and then he said yes because he didn't want to break up with her i would be really worried about it Sometimes, like, people are afraid of something, but they still want it. Yeah. And having that little extra push can be a good thing. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. sometimes you can be afraid of things and the fear is not as warranted. It's kind a of jumping like, in the deep end thing. Like, kind of. Yeah. Sometimes you need to take a leap of faith. Right. Yeah. And I think that, I don't know. I think it could work. Am I crazy? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh, I hope Jimmy and Chelsea say no. Yeah, One I do too. Jimmy's going to say yes. You think so? Mm-hmm. I do. I think Jimmy's going to say yes. And I think Chelsea's going to say no. Yeah, I could see that. Weirdly. I do. I didn't feel like that was the direction I didn't it was going to go. But... And it confuses me constantly, but I really think he's going to say yes. Is that all the couples? Yeah. <laughs> because obviously Jeremy and Laura, thankfully, are over. How do you feel about Jeremy and Sarah Ann? Yeah, are they going to make it? Jeremy Sarah Ann jet ski scene was just manic as hell. And it was terrifying. And they, they, they shot it that way on purpose. But, but it, it also... They were doing that right after that big blowout, laughing maniacally on jet skis. Yeah. That was... They both have so little concern oh. for other people <laughs> that I honestly feel like it could work between the two of them. No, but that's why it wouldn't work over the long term because they're why? too selfish because one of them would end up... Well, I think sometimes people like that want to be in relationships with people give a lot because yeah. they want to take and eventually they're going to butt heads. Yeah. And... um yeah. I mean, that's that's why I don't think it would work. I also agree that Sarah Ann just, like, kind of seems like she wants to be on TV. Yeah. It was funny when you pointed out, like, when she, she was at looking the camera, at the camera. Right as she was saying that, that wasn't an accident. <laughs> People can't always control their eyes. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. I'm not really good at seeing tells, but I'm 99% sure that's what that what is. Yeah, yeah, I think so, too. All right, I mean, what do you yeah. think? I'm going to get I'm gonna get ripped up for gonna, my clay I've never seen, actually, any... Almost anybody come at us for our opinions. 
There's like one that's person true. that does. Yeah. That's you true. You know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> everyone, if you're watching, I'm kind of impressed. Everyone in general is very, very respectful. And, and I you also... You would disagree the disagreement, and I love that. Yeah. And I understand that my opinion about Clay is not popular. And I also understand that I am naive and gullible. I will say that over and over again. And I am glad that I'm not in the dating pool because it would not go well for me. But, um, yeah, so what do you think? Yeah, what do you I think? I mean, tell me I'm wrong about, I'm probably wrong about Clay, yeah. but tell me I'm wrong and, um, and why you think I'm wrong. Or if we got any facts wrong here, yeah. um, we're, we're open to fact checks and, <laughs> uh, different opinions. Absolutely. Yeah. I love and then it. We'll be, we'll be chatting with you in the comments if you want to. Yes. Yes. So like, subscribe, and we will see you next week and see who yeah. the hell gets married. All right. Thank you. Bye. Then I got it now. And I started going, Oh, that was a tearjerker. Hey, we're going to go on a cruise this summer. You should come with us.